Welcome back to another edition of Time Travel Tuesday with our favorite video historian, Bill Hudson. But I had nothing to do with this video. That's right, because I this pulled one. this one. This one did it. Okay, but you did have something to do with it, actually. Here's the backstory. Bill used to work here back in the 80s, right? 70s, 70s and 80s, 80s for yes. about 12 years. And you had many adventures. In fact, I was talking to Bill about what are some of the most memorable adventures you had during your time here. Okay. And so, I think I found one, but I need you to fill out the story for me. Oh, okay, let's, let's go. Let's take a look at 1981. Oh my God, the drugstore. Yep, City Drugs. City Drugs, those two people robbed it, took everybody in the store hostage, then the Sheriff Lavelle Pitts traded himself for the hostages. So Lavelle and Joe Coram went in. Then Tom Haskins, who, that's him there. I knew him, his family, his mother, his father. He asked for me. He wanted to make a public statement. Oh, my goodness. So I went in. Because he knew you from the Because news, he or? knew me. Wow. I went inside. I remember Leroy French, the chief of police, said, Bill, you don't have to go in. And I said, no, I'll go in. Were you, were you actually shooting this video? I shot this video, yes. Okay, so this is real news footage from back yes, in 1981. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. I'm just astounded when I saw it. It's well, just... Well, when I walked in, I did not know there was a girl with him. I did not know he was doing drugs. He was shooting up in the neck. Oh, he had a belt around her neck. She couldn't find a vein. But finally, he got so messed up, she had a gun in her hand, pointed it at myself while he was stabbing her in the neck with a needle. But why did you, why did you end up going in there? I mean, Because he had asked to, for me. Weren't you terrified? Not at the time, but I am now. <laughs> Looking back at it, right? Looking back at it, I'd never do it again. Wow. But at the time, I didn't think any, and that's Lavelle Pitts talking about it afterwards. Because this was obviously a huge, huge story in 1981. Oh, God, yes. When this happened. Now, was anybody hurt? Nobody was hurt. Amazing. No. They, they, they were arrested. Joe Coram finally jumped Tom Haskins. He got finally, the drugs got to him. Mm -hmm. And they found drugs on him and her several days. Oh, that's me. Look oh, at my that. God. I got I, hair. Look at the old Bill oh, Hudson. Oh, my face. God. There you are. Yes, ma'am. You like to throw my old video in there every now and then, so I decided to turn the tables. Boy, you, you did. <laughs> Look at you. But really, this was something you were talking about. It obviously, with Tom Hips, it looks like the community was just probably really yeah. shaken up over this case. You know, what it did, I mean, a lot of people didn't like it. Mm -hmm. But one day I was someplace at a corporate office, and the woman says, excuse me, aren't you Bill Hudson? I right. said, yes, ma'am. She says, you were in the drugstore. I said, yes, ma'am. And I thought I was going to catch a Dickens. That's Hoard. He's a psychologist or something like that. Hmm. Oh, well, this was a huge story. And when Bill told me this was the most memorable story that he remembered covering during his yes. time here, I felt like we needed to go back into the archives and find it. Yes, so. that's it. But, I mean, when I was in, when this woman asked me, if I was Bill Hudson, she says, you did more by going in that drugstore to keep my daughter away from drugs. That made it all worth it. What an amazing and story. And I had a circuit judge tell me, he says, Bill, every time that comes on television, I make my boy sit and watch it. Wow. So, so these little, are good things, you know. Little piece of history I dragged up to remind you about a yes, case. Yes, you that did is one we were talking about, and I came across the video and said, we have to I think to show it this. was 81. 1981. Wow. Memorial, Day, Memorial Day? That I'm not sure about. I, it just says 1981. Joe Moore, <laughs> Joe Moore yeah. called me and says, Bill, can you check out this thing? Yep, it was all in his handwriting. When I found it, I'm like, let's show this one. <laughs> if you have questions for Bill, maybe want to talk a little bit more about that historic story, 785-3364. And, of course, we'll share more on this, more of that video, too, at our WJHG YouTube page because that was something. Yes, it was. All right, Bill. Yes, it was. Thank you. Let's do this again next week. Okay, I'm all for it. All right, another edition of Time Travel Tuesday coming your way next week, but right now we have to take a break.